They're off in the Ben Ally. There goes Conquest Enforcer from the far outside. Take to the streets and Birdsong. And between those two, Blofeld comes away running in the fourth position. Conquest Enforcer keeps moving forward from the outside. Now starts to angle down toward the rail to get clear with the lead by a length into the first turn. Bird Song goes second up on the outside, just off the leader's flank. And then Take to the Streets is third against the rail, saving ground around that first turn. Joined there by Scuba to the outside and fourth. Watershed fifth. Blofeld is in sixth. Gap of seven more lengths back to Eagle and Framento side by side at the back. 23 and four fifth seconds the time for the opening quarter. Conquest Enforcer, the leader, three parts of a length for the move up the back stretch. Bird Song travels along comfortably toward the outside and second a length. And then Take to the Streets third by a neck. Scuba, the great. Fourth up on the outside. Watershed, fifth in between horses. Blofeld, sixth back toward the rail. Gap of two to Eagle, starting to catch up with the group now, along with Fermento, who stays right with him. 47 seconds the time for the first half mile. Conquest, Enforcer, and Bird Song now slugging it out for the lead, separated by a head. Scuba, third, three wide on the turn, two lengths from the front. Watershed, fourth in between horses. Take to the streets, backs up into fifth position as they turn for home. And then Blofeld, Eagle, still far back. Fermento last. Birdsong leads. Watershed to second. Quarter mile to come. And Birdsong is on top. Birdsong by three lengths into the stretch. Watershed is second. Eagle swings out to the center of the racetrack in third. Blofeld is fourth. Changing lanes from in between horses. Here's Watershed. Final furlong of the Ben Ally. Coming after Birdsong. Eagle is third. Watershed takes the lead at the 16th pole. Watershed in front for Paco Lopez. And a Big day continues for Godolphin and Karen McLaughlin as Watershed takes the Ben Ally. Winner of Keeneland 7th, the 87th running of the Grade 3 Ben Ally, number 3, Watershed. Three wins today for Godolphin Racing of Muhammad Al Maktoum, trainer Karen McLaughlin, and Darley as breeder. Paco Lopez is the winning jockey aboard Watershed, a five year old son of Bernardini out of Thousand Islands by Dubai Millennium, bred in Kentucky. Nine furlongs, one minute, 50 and four fifth seconds. Presenting the trophy for the Ben Ally is John McStay, former senior steward of the Irish Turf Club and current director of the Curra, home of the Group One Keeneland Phoenix Stakes. Watershed wins the Ben Ally under Paco Lopez, trained by Kieran McLaughlin for Godolphin Stables. Three wins today for you, for Godolphin. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Paco rode a great race. It's always wonderful to win here in my hometown of Lexington at Keeneland. It's a great crowd and great people, and it's fun to win. How about this horse, Watershed, coming back here today? He's, you've been ha having him on the turf and back and forth. You think dirt is where he belongs? Yes, it was. We tried the turf last time. He ran well, but we thought he was better on the dirt, so we were happy everything worked out today. Well, congratulations. A big win this afternoon. Congratulations to you and Godolphin. A good ride by Paco Lopez. Watershed, winner of the Ben Ally.